Raptors superfan is getting now the Hollywood treatment. Actor Cal Penn announcing he's going to produce and star as Nav Batia in an upcoming biopic. And Nav joins us this morning with his reaction to it. Hey, now, oh, wait, there's Cal, there's Nav. Nav, can you hear me this morning? Yes, I can. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, here, just so you know what's happening. I can hear you, but I can't see you. Have you turned oh. your camera off by any chance? No, no. Can you see me now? I can see you now. This is starting so well. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Hey, great to see you. Listen, if this was in Hollywood, we would just say cut and do it again. But, you know, we're on live TV. <laughs> How are you feeling yes. about your story being made into a Hollywood... You're going big time now in a Hollywood movie. Uh, I do. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm, I'm just in in the ninth heaven right now. You know, I mean, few months ago, there were a lot of uh, production house from all the, all over Hollywood to Bollywood and in between yeah. who wanted to tell my stories. And I asked my manager, Rinku, who owns Yellow Mango Films, to look into that. And one of the producers uh, from Stampede, John Berg, really stood out and uh, it was going to become a reality. And they asked me that who should portray you? I said, well, I want somebody as good looking as me or closest to it. <laughs> and without hesitation, without hesitation, I said, uh, uh, Ken, uh, Cal Penn is going to be the one because first of all, I love his acting. I loved his movies. And also he worked for my heroes, the Obamas. So it was a very easy choice for me to come up with Ken, uh, Cal Penn. Okay, so like a lot of people say, hey, if I were going to make a movie, I'd want this person to play me. But you actually have that happening. I want to remind everybody, this is what Cal Penn had to say about you. The crowd loves him. To see what a source of pride he is for Canadians and all basketball fans really makes me smile. His story is one of unity, which I'm especially excited and proud to bring to life. So are you, I have a lot of questions, bear with me. Are you in talks okay. with Cal? And do you have any creative input? I don't know. Yes, I think I will all around me will have the creative input. My wife, my daughter will have the creative. But in the end, it's the producers and the directors who are going to decide. And I think Cal Penn is going to be the big factor, as you all know. He's a writer. He just came out with a very big book, which is going very strong. And, uh, you know, so I think there will be some creative there where we will have the inputs for him. But in the end, they are the ones who are going to decide that. Okay, here's my next question, Nav. Who is playing your wife of 40 years, Mrs. Superfan, uh, Arvinder? <laughs> and who is paying your beautiful daughter, Tia? I don't know anything about that. Let them, we are just, it was just decided, uh, announced on Friday. And, you know, my documentary also came out mm -hmm. at the same time. So I'm, I'm really crowded with it. But at the end, I believe it will be the directors and the producers who are going to decide who plays who. Okay, well, you might have a say in this. Is Drake going to make a cameo, maybe? Who knows? Yes, maybe yes. Maybe some other guys might play some cameo also. Maybe I might play a cameo also. <laughs> You'll pull a Stan Lee and just be somewhere in your own movie? Yeah, I guess they will. I don't know. They might make me do something silly or whatever it is. And whatever the director said, as long as the movie comes out, I had only one condition. I want a good-looking guy to represent me because I'm known for my looks, you know. And I think I have Cal Penn. Rest is all up to them. Listen, you know, there may be some surprises for people uh, that are coming out of this film, uh, learning about your life. One of the things that surprised me learning from your documentary is that you're 70. Yes, I am. You look I am amazing. 70 and... Well, thank you very much. You know, uh, you know, God is good to me, and I try to live a clean life. And I guess that uh, I hope that I have a few more years left on me to see this movie. You came to Canada in 1984 from India. Anti-Sikh riots forced you to leave that country. Are we going to learn anything else about you in part of your backstory in this biopic? Yes, I think uh, you will learn quite a few other things, incidents and other things. But again, like I said, I, I, directors, they're going to start working on it. It's a long, long process for the movie to come out. And uh, like I said, Cal Penn is himself a very, very good writer. And I believe that it is going to come out to be a very, very good show. This is going to be very exciting for the Toronto and the Raptors. It is going to be good for Canada. And I tell you, it is going to be amazing. And Cal Penn is taking so much interest in it that I can tell you he's coming here on the next Friday to sit with me at the game. And he's going to start understanding how I behave with the opposing players, how I call, talk trash with the opposing coaches and players. So he's going to be coming here a few times to Toronto to understand who Superfan is.
Well, thanks for that tidbit. I'm coming to the game this Friday with my son. I'm going to miss you. Well, I won't miss you. You'll be there, but I'll miss Cal Penn. That's too bad. Hey, how are you feeling about the team this year just before we go? Hey, I'm feeling good. I think give them a few more games. You saw it yesterday. They beat a good team in of Washington. And, uh, you know, we are two in a row, and we are going to be playing OKC tomorrow and then a very good team in New York on Friday. And I tell you one thing that uh, you will see some uh, you our players, the young players are gelling together. They are understanding where they have to be during the particular passes and all that. And in the end, you will see that we are going to be in the playoffs. Nav, if you see me standing by hoping to say hi at the game on Friday, uh, I'll give a little wave and hopefully we can say hi to each other in person. Take care. Thank you very much. Oh, you're gone. <laughs> Bye, Nav. All right. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this, be sure to subscribe here or you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.